Hey guys, welcome to the channel. We have a new unboxing. As you can see here, it's my P47 Top RC with the Moki engine. And here we have another box. Let's see what's here. Which plane is this one? Which craft? Is the B24 Liberator from VQ Molos. So let's see what's in the box. Everything is nicely packed. As you can see, I'll show you. So everything is nicely packed. And we'll see what's in it. So we'll check everything is packed, everything, and I'll show everything what's in it so, piece by piece so the first out is the fuselage let me see how this looks it's pretty nicely neatly packed as you can see at the back i have quite a few vq models i don't know if you see here is a p39 vq so um, i'm very happy with these models um, they have few things that they have to be done but you know, I decided that I'm gonna have this one because I feel that um, it's. Um, I heard that it's quite really cool, very nice. So we'll see what it is, how it is, how it looks like. Wow, it's crazy! How this is packed. Well, this is the plane, as you can see, it's quite huge. I have already the B24, 25, and now I have the B24, I'll show you later. But it's a beautiful model, nicely done. Inside, as you can see here, the Bombay doors, everything already painted. Everything also for the bolters, it has quite a few bolters that will be it will be it will be functional okay let me see here it has already a pilot inside oh yeah here is one pilot i don't know where he ah here it's a little bit broken pilot as you can see <laughs> it has his arm ripped off i i thought that this Yes, it is a little bit broken. <laughs> As you can see, <laughs> there is the arm of the pilot. We'll put it in place, we'll glue it, but no problem. Otherwise, the pilot looks quite cool. It's really matte color. One is already inside. As you can see here, let me put it like that. I think you can see it. But yeah, otherwise the plane has a lot of space for batteries, I guess. And uh, I'll be using the 6S batteries. So it has a lot of space, really, really nicely built, really firm plane. I'm really amazed by the whole thing, how this looks like. Has some, uh, there are some screws here, I think for the fuselage. It has, um, I mean, really, really, I'm impressed by the whole thing. I don't know where the battery will fit, because I'll use the 6S batteries. I guess they will come somewhere in front, 4 times 6S batteries. So, we'll see how will that fit. This will be another thing to fit in the batteries. So, I want to go with the 6S setup, but I'll see. You know, this is not gonna be a build, it's gonna be a, how can I say, a winter build. Because at the moment I have enough planes to fly with. I'll put this, this just here, so you can watch and see the whole thing. Oh, you don't see it, it's low. 
There you go. I think you can see a little bit now. Yes, just a little bit. There you go. It's here. So let me see what's next in the box. Well, you have all those small little cowlings. Those are the four cowlings you put on. I'm not gonna put every everything off out from the box because it will take too much time. But yes, the dummy radials, as you can see, we put on and a lot of those little things that they go on top uh, of the engines and everything. So they cover the engines. So that's one thing. Let me see what's next. Okay. The next thing it is see those are the bolters. One second. Let me put that out to see. These are the bolters. Everything is already assembled. Here it will go the um, uh, you screw the um, the for the um, for servo and then it will turn and these are the the things they go on top as you can see see they go like this and then the bolter comes in and it turns whole thing around I guess there are four five five bolters. So, what is next? Okay. Next are everything again very nicely made and put. Let me see. Mm. Uh, we really made an effort on that. What I like is that it has this printed foil on already. Uh, covering, I mean, not foil. Let me. Let me see those. See. Yeah. Quite heavy. I must say, goes the servo, the servo it will be a slim or a mini servo, as you can see, there is not much space, but all is already pre-hinged, uh -huh, hinges are not, but everything is very much fitted, it has a nylon hinges, and it looks quite nice, but it is empty, so those are the two rudders. That's the elevator. Let me see the elevator. Elevator. That is the elevator. Mm -hmm. Okay. Like that. Yes. Elevator is as well. It has nylon hinges. It's not as big as I thought it would be. It's smaller than the B25, as I have 2.4 meters, but it's quite nice. So those are going like this on top, right? So they will be going like this on, I guess, and that's how it's gonna this big so it is not quite big as i thought really mm. okay oh 
you see beside two pilots I got actually two extra pilots I see here there are two extra pilots that I got quite nice you know nice effort by them those small little pieces that are for engine mounts which I have to glue plus there are here the doors the Bombay doors as you can see let me just check that I know there's a lot of pieces inside so I don't wanna I don't wanna lose something but yes you see this is the the um, the landing gear doors front forward wheel and the two main gears nicely painted red beautifully beautiful nice painted as you can see it's really cool and here are the bombay doors that's what i'm talking about let me just see that because i'm very interested how i'm gonna do that i think you see they are already cut it they come together like this and they work very nicely, very scale, which goes here, right? Can you just see that? So from here, they would then like go down and up. So they will, you know, you can really make them so that they look very, very scale, uh, which I'm gonna make it. I think I'm gonna use the, um, the servo without, um, endpoints and then somehow we'll see i'll see how i'm gonna do that that's my project that's my big thing for this plane and then you have all these small little pieces that go that i'll i'll have to glue so there is a lot of gluing here i can see and we have here all the guns i'm not gonna open that all the bolts all the small little things that go beside and all the nylon hinges they have nylon hinges some of them they are quite nice and sturdy i see uh, of course the the wheels so all the small little things are here and then here i have another two these are already made. So what is that? I don't know actually what is that. These are the engines, the engine mounts. These are the engine mounts as you can see. See those engine mounts that you mount the engine on. So I actually don't know what are those. Here are the batteries for batteries. Uh, which I don't know as well where they go. I have to check that. But yeah, I don't know where this is going. I have to check. Ah! Ah, those are the... I can see now. Oh, right. Oh, yeah, th those are the turrets. Those are the turrets. That's a part for the turrets. Mm, which you glue them on, I think, on, on, onto those turrets. Um... And you have to make and here are the wheels as well i can see and some other stuff so i'll have to check that what's that all about i have no idea and now here is the wheel meter 2.8 meter warbird 
it's well, it's uh, um, it's one to twelve scale, and that's how the, this looks like. Oh, that's so big! I'm putting it out. <laughs> They are very much it has this paper behind. Uh, what's that for? You know, for protection, but it's nice how they made. You see the hinge is already inside. The flaps are are going outside. Are those um, power flaps? So as you can see, they go outside. There you go. They come inside. Here are the mounts for the gear, which I still haven't ordered. I'll have to order. I mean, it's ordered, but it is um, coming late. So those mounts, I think they go here. See, they will go like that on, as you can see, like this on, and then everything is mounted. It's four engine, four engine thing. So um, yeah, the. As you can see, everything is beautifully done, beautifully made. It's a very, very slick wing. It looks like almost like a, a glider wing. Mm. So I think this is gonna be a beautiful, beautiful bird. In the air will look awesome. As you can see, I took it out of the box and actually one wing is damaged. Um, it came damaged because the box was damaged at the back. So I think it took a hit here, as you can see that. Well, now you can see just a little bit assembled. It's a humongous bird. At the back is top RC, 2.4 meters, P47. Then it's a VQ, 2.1 meter, P39. And here is the VQ, P, a B, 24. It's huge, it's humongous. There is a little bit of a dent, as you can see here, which I will have to repair, but hopefully nothing big and the, the bird will fly great. So that's it, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe and uh, let me think what you think in the comments. I will be working on this and I will keep posting you.